Here's the Weatherlands forecast here yet again. Uh, pretty decent amount of precip possible here. Even a little bit of snow. Just fucking don't want that shit around, but eh. Anyways, uh, warm for the next couple days here, and then Friday, then Thursday night we get some rain going on, and then Friday, nine. Let's just go by date. Nineteenth, we got a good bit of rain and maybe a little bit of mixing in some snow. Friday night, nineteenth in the night. Twentieth is just straight up chance of flu, flur, few flurries. Twenty first is like. Mainly showers, maybe some wet snow mixed in, I guess. The 22nd, just showers. Uh, 23rd is just flurries in the nighttime hours. Yeah. Hold it here for just a little bit longer. And then the 24th is mainly rain, maybe a little bit wet snow mixed in. 25th is mainly rainy yet again with just maybe some wet snow mixed in and then 26th is just mainly flurries in the nighttime hours 27th is just mainly rain showers with maybe some wet snow mixed in and then afterwards is a little dry period I should mention environment Canada has jack shit other than one day of some showers I believe that's for Thursday night and that's it so the weather now is on a really higher upper end of the scale in terms of the precip. So, yeah. I'll uh, leave you guys with that. And I'll see you guys later on today, if not tomorrow morning. Yeah. Alrighty, it's the forecast from the weather now here. Environment Canada is starting to pick up on the precip, but still pretty blah. Anyways, though. This is what the weather is going for here. Got quite a bit of rain tomorrow. 90% chance as well. And then Friday, 19th, looking interesting. Been watching those days. It looks like Thursday night might be something interesting to watch. I'm not overly sure what it will be, but maybe something linear in nature. Either messy or actually something defined. But either way. And then Friday is going to be a solid thunderstorm threat, our second one this month. I mean, it's not uncommon, but, well, it's not rare, but it's pretty uncommon. Uh, anyways, after that, starts uh, getting on the colder side, you can see here. Get some rain, some mixtures. Yeah. Overall, looking pretty, yeah. Now I think about it, I should probably check tomorrow and Friday. I forgot to check those so far this morning. And then beyond that, though, it's pretty blah. It's on the drier side. And we just got maybe some snow <laughs> and a mixture on the last day of the period. <laughs> yeah. Pretty overall disgusting. I'll uh, leave you guys with that. I'll see you guys later on today, if not tomorrow morning. Interesting looking day. Well, actually, interesting looking tonight and tomorrow. So, tonight we got 40% chance of showers this evening, then a few showers beginning this evening. Then wind south 20, guessing at 40, becoming light this evening. Might get some linear stuff, I'm not too sure with that yet, but we'll see how things go. But anyways, Friday, we got a 40% chance of showers in the afternoon with a risk of thunderstorms. Za, plural. <laughs> and that looks like to be an all afternoon thing. And then Friday night, 6% chance of showers. Get a little break Saturday there. Then Sunday, a 40% chance of showers changes to a 6% chance of showers at night. And then Monday, and there are 6% chance of showers, which I believe becomes cloudy skies Monday night, I believe. But either way, tonight and tomorrow is looking interesting. Tonight, because something linear may happen because the cold front is pushing through, and tomorrow because, well, it's a thunderstorm risk. Yeah. Well, I'll uh, leave you guys with that. I'll see you guys later on today, if not tomorrow morning. Yeah. 
definitely. Here's the temperature today. I haven't done a temperature update in a while, so I thought I might as well do one right now. But, pretty flock here. It's about 13 degrees, still climbing. I suspect it'll probably get to, up, if it does manage to, get up to about 14. If it stays clear ish as it is now, I think it'll get up to 14 degrees. And if it does, I'll show you guys that. But, yeah. I'll leave you guys with that though. I will uh, see you guys later on today. If not, tomorrow morning. Yeah. Alrighty, boys. Something linear coming up here from the whole. I think it's coming up from the southwest, or if it's going straight up. Can't really tell that yet, but based off the fact that cold front. It's just exited the coastal area and it's actually uh, pretty much at this point entering the interior. What I'm suspecting is that it's, well, right there. Uh, we'll be waiting here. Temperatures are respectable, 9 degrees. We'll watch that drop like a bomb. There's some cellular stuff like messy crap from down here. And yeah, we'll see what happens. So it is gradually intensifying as I'm um, seeing here on radar. I'll uh, leave you guys with that. I'll see you guys later on tonight. Here we go. Alright, I'm taking a quick peep outside here. The line has really picked up. I can't show you guys yet because the update's not out. But the last update was holy fuck. It jumped up from like I'd say, I think it was about 30-ish DBZ. 30, 35 dBZ max to about 35, 40 dBZ max. So shit's getting going. It's just a matter if it's going to be coming this way. It's hard to tell right now. But if I were to hedge any bets on which way it's going, it's northeast, east. Maybe east, northeast. It's hard to tell. But I'm going to go check outside, see how the winds are. Because while I was out there earlier, it was pretty dead. So, yeah. To put up my rearing cage. Oh. Wow. Well. I guess that says everything. It is fucking warm as fuck outside right now and increasing, so I assume the winds have kicked up here. Holy shit. All I'm saying right now is we better not be... ...lose any power because I got a bunch of fucking tweets and shit and i rather not redo all that fucking shit. This is not the day for that. <sighs> Night for that. I'll uh, see you guys outside. Oh my god. What the fuck? Yo, silent warm, warming trend. Holy shit. There is not a breeze. I came out here because usually when the temperature increases two degrees in about a fucking hour or so, there's a breeze. But there is, is barely. It's like I can feel a very, 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 very light breeze. But just for reference, the line is just behind those mountains way back there. Ah, uh, so, yeah. If it's any good, I might bike up to that spot while I look out. But, I think I'm better off just staying here. If it gets maybe strong enough that I get a little bit interested for lightning, maybe. We'll see. But just to put it in perspective how clear it is right now, you can see the star there. And I assume the rest of it's just high cloud cover blocking some of it. But it is pretty much clear right now. Pretty much beyond this. Ah, uh, this is not your typical, this is not a typical day. Typical night of just some showers coming in. This is going to be, uh, it's going to wallop in. I got a suspicious feeling. It's typical March weather. I'm going to go ahead in now. Well, we'll see what ends up happening. It looks like... It's coming up. But we'll see. So everything... Uh, well, I mean, it's deceiving because the front... Obviously, ahead of the front, the, uh, the flow is obviously a lot different than along and ahead of behind it. 
So that's, but you can, I don't know. We'll see. We'll continue to watch, but I gotta get this forecast done before anything does end up happening. So, yeah. Here we go. Okay, boys. We got ourselves something here. You can even see the fucking outflow of it right here. So we got a line of fucking storms coming in right now. It's probably not going to produce lightning again, but it's worth showing right here. We're going to be heading out to our lookout spot right in uh, about five minutes or so here. I just realized actually how far away it is still. We got some time. And there we go. This whole entire thing is producing fucking light. New lightning detection right up there. That's new. It's a whole new lightning detection. I don't know if you can see it. There we go. A whole new lightning detection on the northern end of that coming right this way. So, we're going to get our asses going here. Here we fucking go. We don't need to show environment camera shit. We're going to set my lights on and my bike and all that. Get a GoPro set up just in case. And we're going to go. Holy shit. And just to further confirm that. Two strikes down here. I'm over here. No strike right there. Oh, oh, baby, it's producing, it's producing. <laughs> oh, my God, we got to go, yes. First thunderstorm of the year coming in. Well, former thunderstorm at least. Here we go. Oh, okay. It may not seem like this much yet. But I can see it. Very faintly. Get a little early. If things take a little too long, I'll head back down. Bitch. If only if things take too long. So, well, that's it. Wait for a bit. Watch it come in. Oh, it really start becoming visible once it comes over the mountains. It really is, really, but... A little bit further. I got you onto the lake. So that's when it starts getting... When the city lights start emitting. Started brightening up the actual thing. But either way... It's right back there. It's dead ass right there. It's well over the mountains now. It's literally just awaiting it now. Now, the issue with this is because I'm up, up here, I'm gonna need a good lead time to get down. So I'm up here to watch it slowly come in. Well, not slowly, but watch it come in. But then fucking book it. Well, and for lightning, and then fucking book it. I mean, realistically, it has a chance to produce lightning before it makes its full way over. Nine times out of ten, it's going to pop off one, but... Uh, the camera's picking it up well. It's right back there. It's kind of like... It's right near West Kelowna right now. Across the lake and just a little bit southwest of Kelowna. I should say West Bank. That's West Bank. But it's right there. I can see it. It's very faint. I took some high uh, ISO. I took some high ISO shots. High ISO plus exposure shot, and it's right there. So we got no concern about it missing. It's just. Switching. They were coming out of the southeast. Now they're blowing right out of the south. They were blowing out of the southeast, south. Now they're blowing right out of the east here. East, southeast. I think that's because of what I'm looking at.
Right now, these are probably like 10, 20 key things. It's nothing much. Oh my god. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that is looking like a textbook shelf guard right there. That is looking like a textbook shelf guard. I'm dead ass to wait for this fucking one whole flash. Like, I'm not expecting frequent anything. It's a simple flash. Just remove my keys, okay. I'll give it another minute here, and then I'll pop back. Come back. It's so hard to tell. But it's right there. Like, I think, I swear to God, I can see the lower, I can see, right, right there, I swear to God, I'm seeing lower hanging clouds right there coming in. Yo, oh, there it is. Oh my God, look at it, it's right there. Fall, it's right fucking here. And there's the dust cloud from it, and then the rain's behind it. It's right fucking there. It's literally right there. Holy shit. Now I see it. Before, now I can. It's right there. It's literally just crossing the lake now. Oh my god, I think we should... As I speak of that, the winds are kicking up out of east. I think it's time to allow this thing to show its ugly face right over home. Because if I leave too late, I'm going to give it a little bit longer. It's still, it's still just, and it's like probably a good, it's probably still a good bit over the lake. But if it was like, let's say downtown, it's right fucking there. I don't know if those lights just went out down there, but if they did, this fucking wind's probably starting to whip. Oh my god! Look at the state of the shelf cloud! Oh my god! Two minutes with you, but I think it's a minute thirty. Mark will go. We'll go bike clean. I don't know. It's East Indians. Crap. But you know what? Fuck the Castro. It's right there. right there. Look, it's such a beautiful shelf cloud. We gotta go. This is a beautiful shelf cloud coming in. Holy shit. Beautiful shelf cloud coming right over.
Alright, so I'm back home. There it is. I'm gonna go get my GoPro hooked back up and then put down in front, in the front. And from there, wait for it to come in. Here we go. And if I had any doubt, maybe not lightning anymore, but if I had any doubt, it's not gonna make it. Here we go. It's right fucking there. We're ready. I'm gonna get my GoPro all put together. Let's go. Oh my! Oh my god! Piss sake! Oh my god! Okay, GoPro. Let's put you there. Okay. Okay. Kestro, Kestro, Kestro. I can't see. It's a fucking dust storm. I can't see anything. My eyes are cocked. I can't see a fucking thing. Oh my god, my eyes. Oh, I'm chewing sand. 34k. That ah, was far from it. What the fuck? perspective. Look how dusty it is down there now. Oh my boy to be. Here we go again. This looks like it's going to sound stronger. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god. The winds are coming out of all sorts of directions. Oh my lord. We're gonna have to head back in a second because it's gonna start pissing a lot of rain. But what we've just gone under is the outflow part of it. Now we're in the fucking. Now we're in the part. So you go, bro. Still standing. Oh, baby, it is. Let's fucking go. We're gonna lift it up a bit. I don't think the footage will be any good, but take what you can take. My thing is, isn't gonna hail. That's another thing. Oh shit. Go! Go! Oh fuck! Go! Holy piss! Good timing. Oh, the swish, 
fresh, fresh, fresh smell of rain. Oh, this piece of wood went flying. Oh. Take what you can take. I mean, uh oh. It's gonna start hailing or something, I don't know. This can't tell. I don't think it's strong enough. It doesn't have enough. Oh my god. Whoa we piss! Woo -hoo -hoo. Holy piss! I was ripping! What the? Where the hell did that come from? Oh shit! Oh my god, down there it's whipping. Oh my god. Oh, whoa. Wood's fucking flying. Fucking hell. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh my, oh my goodness. It's still going, we just gotta get on this side. Oh my goodness gracious. Well. We haven't had any storm of the year qualities so far this year. That can be this 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 is a good start. <laughs> oh my god. I'd say I estimate these were at least 60. Holy shit. Oh, my screen's dirt all over it. The sand. Ugh, oh, it's getting wet now. Fuck. Oh my god. Let's see. Pick up something here. So she's still blowing. Still trying to blow a bit. I think it's done though. Yeah, most part it's... Oh my god. Look at that. She's... Still roaring. Wow. So we should... Flying all over the place. <laughs> oh my god, that's insane! <laughs> Holy shit! Where did this come from? Uh, it probably came from down there. Deconstructing that sandbox has been the sandbox has been there for years. Oh my god! <laughs> wow! May have not gotten lightning, but 
a right good shelf cloud. Probably some of the strongest wind. Well, the strongest winds of the year so far. What a start. Surprise, all that's happened. <laughs> oh my god almighty. What the fuck? <laughs> we did it. <laughs> we got something I expected. Nam was like, nah, you're not gonna get anything linear. H triple R, the whole entire fucking night was literal. The whole entire day was. Well, I don't wanna say the whole entire day, but most of the day was triggering something linear coming through. Look what fucking happened. H triple R sometimes is. It's just more often right than wrong around here. Oh crap. It scared me. So, shit, this started sounding. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit's really still trying to go. Post frontal winds are bonkers still. Love me a good old cold front. Fucking hell, it's well past. We're just in the. Post frontal stages now. Incredible. That. That's a storm. <laughs> there was a couple signs. So we've had a roof, roof redone. Signs placed up. I wonder if they're still standing. It's the rain thing that. It's the fucking winds that are insane. So. We start. A piece of wood. Went flying. Oh, they ripped, they ripped right off this thing. There was wood here. They got a topple down. Left the gate open on purpose. Oh my god. That scared me for a second. Is that sign still there? Yep. Still flailing. Oh, and now we got ourselves a thunderstorm risk tomorrow. I don't think this is enough to cause it. Damage, and even if so, I'm not going to check it out. It's, yeah. it's not worth my time. It was, eh, eh. Might be, nah, I'm probably not going to bother. That would be in the morning if I wanted to check it out, obviously. Whew. What a wind event. I'm seeing a wind event. Well, all these cars passing by make it sound like the winds are kicking back up. Back up to the original peak. <laughs> so deceiving. That was one hell of a windstorm. Fucking hell. That's the one thing about March events. They're always so dusty. <laughs> like, it's always dusty. Jesus Christ. Well, we'll edit this video after tomorrow's event. Tomorrow's thunderstorm risk. So obviously I'm not going to have time tomorrow with the thunderstorm risk. Anything happen back here? Just curious. Never know. Yeah. No, nah, nothing. Whew. Well, I'd estimate those were at least... In the, oh jeez, in at least the 60k range, that was for darn sure. I think I'm even underestimating that. Beautiful. Now it's just going to be some post-frontal gusty winds. Stunning. 
fucking stunning. Let's head in. <laughs> what a fucking start. Oh my lord. <laughs> Beautiful. Wow. Alright, so. Aftermath here. This is what the radar was throughout it. What a fucking cold front, man. At first I was doubting it was coming in, then it just warped us. Beautiful. That was our thunderstorm. They actually issued a thunderstorm risk as it was coming in. It was more than capable of it, just nine of vertical lift. But yeah, unreal. Let me just move a different way here. Oh. Incredible. That's a one way to start. <laughs> one way to bring in the storm season here. Two, well now technically three thunderstorm risks. Two, well, one past, one ongoing, one tomorrow, or in the future. Incredible. And then this is the forecast now. Four o'clock here. It's probably still worth showing it. It was probably still worth showing either way, sorry. Because Friday is now a 30% chance of showers in the afternoon with the risk of a thunderstorm late in the afternoon. It's just singular now. But then there's tonight, risk of a thunderstorm late this evening. It's already 10 o'clock. But yeah. And then wind south 30, gusting at 50. Becoming light. Come on. 71k, boys. 71k at the airport. That seems fairly reasonable. Oh, uh... Show you guys beyond that in a little later on. But yeah. I'll leave you guys with that for now though. I'll show you guys wins later on. And yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> so they even went further at 1039 now. And went to go on now to say showers only before morning then mainly cloudy. But throughout that a risk of a thunderstorm. <laughs> So we got thunderstorm risk all night apparently. And then winds southwest 40 gusts in the 70 becoming light the poor full morning. Winds are fucking like they're barely gusty. You can barely consider them gusty. <laughs> ay ay ay. If anything it should be upping tomorrow's probability to a 40% chance of showers with the risk of a thunderstorm. But yeah. And then from there, now we're sitting under a piss ton of rain here. Well, not a shit ton of rain, but this is a good healthy dose of it coming down. Good few millimeters an hour. Probably end up with, uh, I'm going to give a save about five millimeters of rain by morning. Five to ten. The way things are, it looks like it's stalled right over us. Oh, I'll leave you guys with that. I may see you guys later on tonight. If, well, yeah, maybe later on tonight, if not tomorrow morning. Probably later tonight. Not a heavy rain, but the drops are huge. A little gusty as well. See you guys in the morning. Yeah. Here's the forecast today. 
Uh, so it's same percentage on Shire South News, the risk of a thunderstorm still. Wind southwest 20 gusts at 4 this morning. Meh. Nah. Well, becoming that. Uh, then tonight. Sure. Uh, 6% chance of showers for the risk of a thunderstorm early this evening. Yeah. And then Saturday, uh, another 30% chance of showers late in the afternoon. It's Wednesday yet again, becoming southwest 20 gusts in the 40 near noon. And then Sunday, uh, 40% chance of showers change to a 70% chance of showers Sunday night. So, yeah. Uh, I'll uh, leave you guys with that. I'll see you guys later on today. See how things pan out. Yeah. After a more after an afternoon after an evening of hell. Mm. Well, it's, it's reasonable to say point two because it's been left out sitting for a little while this morning. So, yeah, point two inches. So yeah. with them. See you guys later on today. See what happens. Alright. Still starting to fire off. Nothing much. To really note yet around here. I will show you guys outside in a little bit. But yeah, so far pretty blah. Nothing really much yet. See you guys outside in a little bit. Yeah. It's that time of the year again. I love it. It's about all oh, that's really visible. Looking down here, I see Jack Squat. Yeah, it's overall pretty glum. Nothing really else visible. Yeah. See you guys later on today. I think that <laughs> well more than safe to say the sandstorm rescue is a bust. <laughs> oh wow. I'm gonna get a time lapse going on this. This is amazing. First time lapse bullshit of this season. And in the process. Look at this down here. Not time lapseable, but wow, we're really getting going. Well, I want to get a time lapse going, not on this, but it's right. This over here, and yeah. Wow, it's amazing. Yeah, I got my first time maps of the season going. It's not it's not a thunderstorm, but hey, it's something. That was something that I know, but I think it's OFB outflow. Well F F O D O F D outflow dominant now. It's an OFD storm. What's actually happening? Which is Common during this time of the season. 
So now we're getting affected by it. A continuously extending fucking very, very top of its base. <laughs> That's spreading. Which is why it signified for quite a rain, or that's for sure. Hail, definitely not. It's not. It doesn't have much vertical. It's got the horizontal, but not the vertical. <laughs> but yeah. It's that time of the year. Well, nothing's really impressive, but it's a good. It's always a nice refresher to get ready for. Uh, Real part of this, real part of the year. Just filled with. Hopefully, it's going to be filled with a bunch of thunderstorms. I will get another severe. Often, I hopefully I can start driving soon. Often, I hope I can pass my test. In May, I could finally maybe catch up to one of these severe things. find the right words and there's no way this is real life there's no telling you're the right girl so i can only say that it feels right it feels right it feels right yeah i can only say that it feels right it feels right it feels right yeah i can only say that it feels right and here's the radar Quite a bit of convection today, not nothing too spectacular, but definitely says it's a fair bit of solid convection. Nothing really thunderstorm quality. It's typical March stuff. The odd cell or two pops off a couple one one or two bolts and that's it. The flashes. Yeah, I'll see you guys later on today. Well, <laughs> little weak ass thing popping over the mountains here. It's trying to make it here. These winds are from the storm itself. It's a fucking outflow from it. Yeah, looking sure. Looking quite. It, it looks quite <laughs> summer like with these, this type of cloud cover here. But either way, looks like garbage. We'll, we'll see what ends up happening. I'll show you guys the radar later on today. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. Pretty blah. Too dry, so it's just a bunch of Virga. And then a little bit of outflow from it. Well, I'll leave you guys with that, and I'll uh, see you guys later on today.
Who's the radar since six o'clock? It's been, yeah, meh. I'll uh, consider ending the video tomorrow. Uh, yeah. I don't know if I want to, but at the same time, because there's another mini storm threat tomorrow, but at the same time, yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna, yeah. I'll probably end that video tomorrow, but we'll... It'll be determined. Yeah, it's to be determined still. I'll leave you guys with that, though, and I'll see you guys uh, in the morning. And this is the forecast today. So, I'll be ending the video short after this here. So, yeah. Today we got a 30% chance of showers this afternoon. With winds becoming southwest 20 gusts and 40 this afternoon. And then tonight, 30% chance of showers all night with a snow level dropping to near valley bottom after midnight. And then with winds southwest 20 gusts and 40 becoming light late this evening. And then tomorrow, even colder, 5 degree high only. And then a 6% chance of showers late in the morning and in the afternoon with snow level rising to only 900 meters in the afternoon. And then when southwest 20 gusts into 40 near noon. And a steady temperature near plus 5, like I said. And then Sunday night is 6% chance of showers. Monday we get a nice little break there, you can see. And then if we scroll her down here. Hold it for a second. Warms right back up after uh, Wednesday. Alright, want to focus? There we go. Uh, after Wednesday, Tuesday night, we got showers possible, continuing into Wednesday, and then Wednesday night, 30% chance of showers, and then Thursday, we're back into double digits. So, yeah. I'll uh, leave you guys with that. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.